Good day, it's Jake Asmo here from Gadget Talk, and today, guys, we are going to move on to part um, four of our um, Grace tutorial, uh, Red Comet Custom. That's right. So after I dry brushing my Grace, check it out. It's now weathered. It's very awesome. Cool. Check it out, and that's awesome. Okay. There. Brilliant. Okay, so focus on the edges and then you go to the inner part. You can also add some um, silver dry brushing there. Okay, I want you to check this out. This is really cool, guys. See that? It look like a metal something. Beautiful. Okay, now I want to maintain this shiny metal effect on my parts of this gray. So I'm going to apply less. This this would be my uh, top coat instead of using the flat. I prepared glossy effect to, you know, so that this silver um, weathered color on my compla would here contrast I'm gonna use this one this is the pledge white one shine and you can buy this anywhere actually this is this technique is not um, very common to some gunpla collectors because they prefer the flat but I tell you guys if you apply the silver weathering on your gunpla and then you put the pledge you're gonna experience that metallic look shiny metallic look so that can only be possible if you use pledge to wipe and shine and it's very very affordable so I'm gonna use this apply this on the um, outer parts of your gumbla those with silver Uh, color is on it Yes, and you can also go to the inner part later on so I'm gonna focus on the outer part first uh, Just for the demonstration. I'll show it to you guys because it's going to shine and That will make your compla look so fucking amazing See that? So you're gonna do this first coating. I think first coat is okay. I'm going to go to the second coat or third coat because that would be too much. Just to make this outer part shine, that's enough for me. So that's it. Okay. The final result would be displayed on a picture, guys. Okay, not on a video style. 